This is a presentation of OPC Systems OPC WPF Quick Chart for WPF 4.0. The Quick Chart is part of a series of controls designed for dashboard applications. The OPC WPF Quick Chart can be used to create applications quickly and easily incorporate live data into your WPF dashboard applications. The controls are intended for use with the .NET 4.0 framework. The quick chart allows for a single view of live data in a strip chart style. Each point has an adjustable point count up to 200 points maximum and an adjustable sample rate or can plot data on data change. The y-axis is also scalable. There are multiple properties that can be controlled by live data from the OPC system service such as the title, the grid background and foreground color flashing and others. The quick chart is designed for one point, but multiple charts can be stacked by setting the background and grid brushes to no brush. For complex trending and XY plotting, please look at the OPC system's trend control. Let's create a WPF application using our OPC WPF quick chart control. First let's start Microsoft Visual Studio 2010 and create a new project. We'll select WPF application and we'll call this Quick Chart. Select the OK button. And from our toolbox, let's select the OPC WPF Quick Chart. We now have a Quick Chart in our main window. Select the chart. Let's look at the common properties. We see that we have point count. This determines the number of points that will be plotted across the width of the chart. We have a sample rate of 1 and the sample is set on sample on data change. If we uncheck the sample on data change, then we can set a specific sample rate. So we will sample a point once every second right now, or we can change that to another value based on seconds. We have a y-axis minimum and maximum. The maximum is currently set to 100, and the minimum is currently set to 0. Under Appearance OPC Systems, we have an opacity tag. This will allow us to change the opacity of the chart and a visibility tag. Under Brushes OPC Systems, we can flash the background and we can set the background color using OPC Systems tags. We can also set the chart grid to flash and also the chart grid color. And we can do the same with the foreground and also the whisker line. Under Common Properties OPC Systems, we have the Enable tag, the Tag tag, the tooltip tag, and under content OPC systems we have the content tag. Let's set this tag to ramp. Select OK. We can also change the content format and let's change this to RPMs and one decimal place. You can also do transforms with OPC systems tag so you can rotate, scale, skew, and translate. We have layout which allows us to change the height, width, padding, margins, z-index. Under brushes we have the background, which is currently set to no brush. So let's set that to gray. We have a border brush. And let's set that border brush to black. Our chart grid lines and our chart line. Foreground color and our whisker line color. Under text, we can set the font family and the font size, bold and italic. Visibility allows us to change the opacity of the chart and the visibility. Let's run our application. Now we can see that we're plotting the RPMs from our ramp. Let's stop our application. Select the chart again. And under Common, let's select Sample on Data Change. And in OPC Systems Tag Configuration, select Local, select our ramp value, and let's change our OPC update rate to 0.1 and apply the changes. Now let's run our application again. Now you can see that we're charting at a much faster rate Now let's change our point count and let's reduce that to 50 points and run our application once more. And now you can see we're sampling very fast and we're only using 50 points to cover the entire chart. For more information on OPC Systems products and features, please visit our website at www.opcsystems.com. And for more training videos, please select the training tab at the top of the page.